Hey, yeah. Y'all asked for it. You know what's going on. I hope life has been treating you well. I hope you've been getting W's and not L's. And today, we are doing what's an Alisar's G Fuel Rotation. I know um, I, I asked you guys to drop a comment in the last video that we did, and y'all did, and I was like, yes, sir, ski. So with that being said, guys, we're just going to jump right into it. We have two honorable mentions, and then we have five tubs that's in the rotation right now, which is basically our top five. If you guys want to see individual reviews for all the tubs being mentioned today, please drop a comment down below. And you know your boy got you guys. It's all for you guys. Come on now. You know I love y'all. But with that being said, we're going to jump right into the honorable mentions. So the first honorable mention is Sonic Peach Rings, guys. Now let me tell you, Sonic Peach Rings literally taste exactly like the candy. If you guys have not tried Peach Rings, if you guys have not tried peach rings, go to your local gas station or the holla store and go snag, go snag yourself. Now, I know they came out with like a chili dogs thing. I don't know if people actually got the chili dogs. It's like Sonic G Fuel tub. I'm not sure if they actually did that thing, but I kind of don't want to know. I feel like some people are going to be mad at me for this flavor not being in the top five, but being in honorable mentions. But, you know, I had to do it anyways, guys. I am sorry. But the flavor, this is actually the first flavor that I ever got in of G Fuel. And I and everyone said, everyone said, like, if you want to start out, you get this flavor or you get Phase Berry. And let me tell you, this flavor lived up to its hype. And the flavor that I'm talking about, guys, is none other than PewDiePie's Lingonberry G Fuel flavor. And as you can see, your boy was a little novice because I took the top off. Because <laughs> I took the top off of it. But let me tell you, and I was actually skeptical about buying G Fuel. And I did like, I did so much research. I watched almost everyone do reviews and do like their top list and stuff like that. And what was on top of their list, like you could not go wrong with PewDiePie's Lingonberry G Fuel flavor. You literally can't. It's sweet. It's delicious. It's like, it's just amazing. I don't know how I would describe it any other way. However, the flavors that I have right now on here, I do think is better than this. I'm, I'm just saying it's gonna be better than PewDiePie's Lingonberry. At number five in my rotation right now, I'm going to have to say, that's hard. <laughs> this is hard because they're all so good. Okay, so number five, I cannot lie. I'm gonna have to go with the Nemesis Ice Tea, the Resident Evil um, G Fuel Nemesis Ice Tea flavor. And basically, guys, this is just like an Arnold Palmer. If you guys don't know what an Arnold Palmer is, it's half lemonade, half iced tea. Throughout my childhood, I drank a lot of iced tea. And for, that, for them to come out with this, you know what I mean? Like, I think it just, it just only fits. It only, I'm like, yo, this kind of reminds me of drinking literally drinking Lipton iced tea and I'm like all right and I can get a kick out of this it's like yes yeah, sir ski number four number four I gotta go with Bobby Boysenberry I cannot lie I know I had Logic's inspired G Fuel flavor Bobby Boysenberry and I was hearing from different people that it was a mix between like uh the black on blackberry and then like a like a raspberry itself and when i tried it i was like bro not only is this fucking scrumptious but it tastes exactly like a grape jolly rancher and i'm telling you candy wise grape has to be among the top tier flavor candy flavors without a doubt candy and soda that's that's without a doubt don't even try to at me okay because it's delicious. Let me tell you, I was not disappointed. And when I was like, yo, I gotta, I gotta go for this again. Like this is this is delicious. And I'm glad that I actually got a tub. I did not get the collector's um, I didn't get the collector's box on it, unfortunately. Like I said, guys, G Fuel, drop a comment. You already know what's going on. The G Fuel Goblins 2021. Number three has to be, has to be without a doubt. Crash Bandicoot's Wumper Fruit. 
now let me tell you guys i know that you guys have seen the different mixes that we've done on one perfume if you guys have not seen it make sure you guys have it's gonna be popping up right about now right about here right and basically what wumper fruit is it's a mango green tea if you guys have never tried mango peace green tea make sure you guys go to your local gas station or your local superstore and go find that out of all the mango flavors that g fuel has come out with with like the mega potion and the scorpions thing this by far is my favorite it's not it's it's a clean flavor it's a solid flavor it's not too sweet and it's refreshing as well like you just can keep sipping on it like on a nice warm hot summer day you just sip on this and you're ready to go you're ready to take on the morning like stop it number one and number two i feel like you guys are gonna be like yo lsr you're smoking that pookie pack you're smoking that some of that yucca that goofy pack but i'm not gonna lie guys i think right now this is just this is just top tier right here like this is just untouchable right now for number two the number two spot for the LSR mix rotation is Phase Clan's Phase X. So, G Fuel Phase X. I wasn't too sure about this. Only the only reason why I bought this is because I saw um, Duck's video on him mixing all the G Fuel flavors together, and he was talking about Phase X. And then he said it was Glacier White Cherry, and I was like, "What the fuck did you just say, Duck?" Did you just say the most immaculate flavor there is in any type of sports drink? Are you talking about like Glacier White Cherry, Powerade, Gatorade, fucking top tier? Don't even fucking at me. Is that what you're saying, Duck? That's what you're saying? You already know I have to scoop that. Yo, Duck hit it. Duck nailed it on the head. This is, that is exactly what White Glacier Cherry is. And I think that White Glacier Cherry is honestly so fucking underrated and underappreciated that not a lot of people, not a lot of people like it. Or not a lot of people talk about it being one of their favorite flavors. And let me tell you, this is really good. And I do think that this would be really good in different like G Fuel mixes as well. I haven't tried it yet, but I really want to because it's also a versatile flavor as well. Right now, number one on the LSR G Fuel rotation is none other than, none other than Mortal Kombat 11 ice shatter when i got ice shatter everyone was saying that it was like a frosted like blueberry and when i saw it on the g fuel website it was like a blue strawberry with like blueberries too and i was like all right now this this looks fucking top tier i might have to invest my money some cactus coins into this and boy let me tell you i was not fucking disappointed at all this is honestly one of my favorite flavors it's like blueberry and strawberry. It's like a blueberry strawberry with like a little hint of lemonade to it. I'm not gonna lie. It's like a, it's supposed to be like a frosted flavor. I know like um a lot of the G Fuel flavors coming out later, like Pink Drip, um, Ice Shatter, even Bobby Boys and Babies. They're supposed to be like frosted flavors. Um, but this right here though, boom, well, you just can't beat it. It's like a bowl of frozen blueberries and strawberries. You blended it, liquefied it, and then you sprinkled some caffeine on it, and bang! This is what you get. This you get literally liquid ambrosia from ice shatter. This is that's exactly what this is. It's just amazing. Comment down below and what do you guys think about my mix rotation? Is there any uh flavors that you think that should have been on there that they didn't make it? Um and let me know what what you guys think and what's your G Fuel mix rotation. This is what I need to know as well. Um, if you guys want me to review the, oh y'all, hold on, hold on. I think this mix right here though, this could be a top tier mix. I just grabbed this on accident, but yo, I think we could do this. Let me tell you, drop a drop a comment down below if you want to see this mix. If you guys want to see this mix. Yo, we can get this fucking party started right now, baby. Like, stop it. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed 
this video right here make sure to leave it a thumbs up and make sure if you guys have not subscribed already hit the shark in the bottom right hand corner of the video or the subscribe button and make sure you hit that bell so when it goes a ring a ling 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 when it goes so when it goes a ring a ling ling LSR is on your screen with that being said this has been your boy LSR speaking treat every day like a Friday and I'll catch you guys later